This is BMW's first M4, the result of a convoluted new naming strategy it has employed across its model range, but be in no illusion that in the saloon-based performance coupe sphere, BMW doesn't only know how to play the game, it pretty much created it. So when BMW launched the M4 back in 2014, its mixed reception didn't so much come as a surprise, but rather bewilderment about what could have possibly gone wrong. Since then, the M4, and its four-door M3 sibling, has undergone multiple revisions, as well as been diversified into the excellent, but eye-wateringly expensive CS and lesser competition pack options. Equipped with the same 3-liter twin-turbocharged straight-six from its initial launch, the M4's speed has never been in doubt, but has BMW been able to reintegrate the finesse which helped define its illustrious forebears? There is no quick way to describe how the M4 drives, suffice to say it could never be described as dull or benign. The M4's complicated reception has not only been affected by its reputation either, because where previous Mies largely had their corner of the market to themselves, the M4 most certainly doesn't, with the charismatic Mercedes-AMG C63, Alfa Romeo Giulia QV and Audi RS5 all raising their game for class owners. So does the M4 still deserve its place at the top of its mount, or has the king been dethroned? Read on to find out.